Hey, good morning to you, beloved. Welcome back to the Morning Minute Meditation. Galatians 4.4, 4. the Bible said, but in the fullness of time, God sent forth his son made of a woman, made under the law to redeem them that were under the law. In other words, Jesus Christ didn't come too early, nor did he come too late. Jesus Christ came right on time. In other words, he wasn't, uh, he wasn't tardy, he was on time. One of the things that we have problem with in this society is that people do not value time. One wise man once said that time is like a coin. It's like the coin of our life. And we either spend it wisely or we let someone else spend it for us. Time is too valuable to waste and it is too valuable to, uh, to leave us in a tardy position all of the time. Uh, I've, I've watched children come to school, numerous parents come sliding in just at the nick of time, and many of them are late with their children. But they're that way about everything in life. The theme song of the church ought not to be when the saints come marching in, but rather when the saints come dragging in, because that seems to be the nature of most places that I get to go and preach. People do not consider time, nor do they use it wisely. It is the first thing that God ever made, this thing called time. The Bible said, in the beginning, there's the first tick of the clock. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. How do you value your time? Can I say it this way? As one old man once told me, he said, if you're on time, you're late, and if you're late, you ought to be ashamed. You're only on time if you're early. Hey, when you go to the house of God, are you on time? Are you in your place? Or can people count on you to be one of those saints dragging in? Hey, think on these things today, friend, and have an on-time day.